So sometimes an inexpensive, easy solution is better than a more expensive custom option. So here we go. We've got a dog leash. This is about a $4 item at most drug stores. It's just a nylon uh, dog leash. This one's a half inch. I also use a one inch one for my heavier DSLR, but I'm just showing you the procedure with a half inch. You do the same procedure. You slip the, the wrist loop portion through the metal piece here in the clip. You see how I'm slipping it through there. Then you slip it over the top. Then you pull it tight. It takes a little wrestling with it to pull it tight because it is kind of a tight fit through there. But you pull, pull both parts of the uh, wrist loop part tight. And then what happens is you basically just have an over the shoulder uh, strap that you can then hook onto your camera very easily. And I like to be able to disconnect my straps very easily because I use various strap solutions for different situations. And you probably see in some of my videos I have a spider holster attachment on my heavy uh, DSLR D700 Nikon but I use a strap here, here it is there's a picture of it I use a one inch strap on it so that whenever I'm not shooting I can just let it hang down by my side I don't have to put it in the spider holster all the time and you notice you can also clip straps on other attach points on the cameras as long as you have a ring that you can attach it to and again very quick and easy to detach it so you can use whatever strap is appropriate to the situation so just wanted to show you how quick and easy it is to take an ordinary five foot dog leash and make it into a very strong camera strap. This is not going to break. This is going to hold whatever camera you want. Again, for the heavier cameras, I'd use the one inch version here. And for lighter cameras, micro four thirds or something, use the smaller one. But they're not going to give way. Let me know how you carry your camera around. Thanks for watching.